Hey guys, Freddy Tech with CFL Tech. We have the My Free Direct TV review and we have it on our Roku device. So we'll get right into it here, launch the app and see what we get. Now you get a quick splash screen and you see a hi Freddy, hello Direct TV back at you. Now when you get into the app here, this looks very familiar. It looks like Direct TV Stream. It looks like Direct TV over internet. So a familiar look here with the interface. Now you have the tiles for your TV up top. So anyone that's highlighted will show the video below, a little thumbnail of it or a tile of the a video. And then if you look to the right, you have more like whichever channel is selected. So that's nice to see, very similar to what you see or is pretty much the same as you see on Direct TV Stream. So let's go into the guide here. Now we counted about 90 channels earlier. And by the way, you can get this service pretty much everywhere on Apple devices, Amazon Fire TV, Android Roku, and Direct TV app, as well as mobile devices. So you can watch this on their website as well. And we'll link the website for my free Direct TV down below. And we have the uh, website image here or video of the website showing you the channels that they offer with this service scrolling through there. So while we're doing the scroll on the guide, we have that going as well here for a minute or so. But look at these channels here. It rolls really smoothly and very nice. Now, when you go into a show, you can also uh, pause. You can also uh, rewind and fast forward. Let's go into a channel real quick. We'll pull up the options here. So you can actually rewind, but right now we don't have the channel on long enough, but we're gonna get out of this so we don't get um, into a copyright problem. But there's your pause, so it works really nice. So there you go with that. But look at these channels. We said there's about 90. Now they're saying about 70 plus pretty much is what it is, but they keep adding more channels, which is really good to see. And we've done several videos on that as well. So they continue to grow. Right now there is no DVR available, but who knows, they may add one here down the road as this becomes more and more competitive. Now you have a bunch of taste made channels. There's one there, taste made food and more. Now we won't go through a lot of the channels. It just takes a lot more time. The channel listings on the website that we'll provide down below for you as well to see which channels become or come are on this service. So there you go, a nice smooth scroll on the Roku device, so that's very good to see. So when you go to the left here, you have all recent favorite sports, kids, movies, and TV shows. Now, it would be nice if they had a music section. That's something they don't have at this time, like Vivo channels and iHeart. They don't have any agreement, I guess, with those you know companies. So eventually we may see something here, but... A lot of other uh, free streamers have the Vivo videos, which is cool. You have 80s and 70s, different genres. So that would be a nice addition for them to add. And that will probably happen at some point. So there you go. You have the different, look at these categories. You have sports. So all of the sports channels here. And you see which ones that come with the free service. And then you have some kids. Well, actually one kid channel right now. They say they will be adding more. And that will probably happen soon as well. And then here are the movie channels that come with the free service. So there you go. And you have TV shows, which will be probably the most of all channels, which is a very basic category. And there you go, quite a few listed, probably the majority of the channels. So that's that. And you can sort by A and Z now with the guide or by the um, channel number. So you could just uh, you know flip this here, right there, A to Z, or by channel number. And you have Jump Today, so you can go from today, um, so we have 11.28 up to 12.9, so you can see how many days out. So if you select 12.9, it shows you what's on those channels at the same exact hour as it is right here, and it'll show you what's on those channels at, on that date. So that's also nice. So let's go out of this here and go to the, um, look at these other options here on the menu. You have Guide, My Library, Sports Central, and On Demand. Now, my library right now, there's no DVR, like we said earlier, so they will tell you to upgrade if you want to get a DVR, which was which would be DirecTV Stream. So you can get a DVR with the entertainment base plan at $86.99 at the time of this recording. So let's go down here to Sports Central, and you see here sports leagues, sports in general, and they show you 
what's on now live. So these are the channels that are on the plan, the free plan that is, which is great. And you have Sports Grid, you have Women's Sports Network, you have ACC and Big 12, Players TV, Racket Sports, Motorsports. So all these motorsports channels here. So a good amount. So really good selection right now for a, a service that's still new. Um, you have someone with experience that worked with Sling that worked on this. Uh, someone did come over to DirecTV um, that did work on Sling Freestream, so they have a good background. They have on demand. So let's go look at this here. Let's look at the movies. And with the movies, you have Movie Sphere, uh, which is from Lionsgate. Now they have a lot of free on demand movies on here. Now they'll also mention upgrade throughout this, you know, the different screens here. Of course, they want to try to get you to subscribe for the live pay TV service, but they also have movies anytime. So you look at this one here, The Immigrant. So it shows you Movie Sphere by Lionsgate. 2014 movie here you can watch now on demand so you have a good amount of movies here to select from which is good to see you have michael keaton movie there so you have some big name stars in here some decent movies all at no charge so that's good to see so let's see here you have a uh, code of honor you have uh, that's with steven seagal so you know some movies maybe a little on the older side is some steven seagal again so they have some good movies at no charge and you have some comedy here you have different categories and more uh movie genres right here let's get out of this and if you go you have networks and you have tv shows as well we won't spend too much time on those as that becomes time consuming and let's go to settings here and see what we have now you have preferences now you have launch preference which is your home location you have parental controls uh, captioning you have autoplay next episode and here's another way you can you know uh, select the guide sorting by alphabetical or numerical and here you have allow notifications so there you go and then if you go art you have auto forwarding that's for the sports uh, for non blacked out probably not much of a thing for the free service when you have the pay service uh, with the different you know sports channels like you know ESPNs and all that um, that would become more of a need you have show game scores as well. Now, there are some game scores that showed in the Sports Central. And you have my favorites. So here you can also select the favorite channels. So you can choose your favorites right here. So here are all of the channels in the plan. And you can just uh, select any one of these like that. And there you go. Now you check them and they'll be back in the uh, guide. You'll see in the favorites. So you can do it that way as well. Or if you go back into the guide, you can select a channel here as well by highlighting the channel and hold the button down, the enter button, and there it is. It is now you see the heart is filled in. So let's look at the favorites. Now we have just three new favorites. We had one earlier, actually two earlier. So now we have a total of five. So we just selected three more. So there they are. You have your free channels listed there. So very easy to add free channel. Uh, Free channels are very easy and also the favorite channels. But there you go. A quick look around here at my free direct TV. I think they'll be adding more channels here continuously going into the new year. And who knows, maybe a DVR is in the future. That would be great to see. And also maybe some music channels would be nice to see. But right now it's a nice service. And, you know, there's a bunch of different free services out there right now. Some of the channels overlap. But, you know, when you look at some of these channels on here, um, you know, the Taste Made channels, they're very good. You know, you have some good quality channels on here, which makes this service worthwhile. And, you know, once you watch some of these channels, you do get into some of the series. And, you know, you may forget that you're actually watching a free service, especially with this interface. It's so good. You know, it's the direct TV. It's the same as Direct TV Stream. So it's really nice they did it that way. So there you go. DirecTV has a good my free DirecTV service. We do like it. So what are your thoughts on this? Have you tried it yet or are you thinking about it? Please let us know down in the comments down below. Also, if it's your first time here on the channel, please hit the subscribe button. Also hit the notification bell so you know when the next video drops in CFL Tech. Freddie Tech will be checking out of this one. And thank you for watching. Soon to be back with another. Take care.